if this video gets to 1,000 likes, I will make this my new Roblox avatar. So make sure you guys like the video and subscribe if you guys want to see this. Yo, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. And in this video, we are here back inside of build a boat once again. And today, we're going to be taking a look at every single code inside of the game, as well with every single secret item location for the month of January and February. Because you guys may know, we just got a pretty big update inside of build a boat with some pretty interesting stuff that you guys can actually still claim right now, lucky enough. So we're going to be going over literally every single loot spawn around the map, every single code and how you guys can unlock exclusive stuff let's go ahead and hop straight into it and get into pretty much everything you guys need to know so we are not going to waste any time and we're going to go ahead and hop straight into it so first thing i actually want to go over is how you guys can just quickly claim some free items if you're on a brand new account or if you've never played build about before or even if you just haven't participated inside the rb battles events go ahead and click this little icon right here and you're actually going to get five free spike blocks right there and also one minigun absolutely for free literally don't have to do anything besides click on an icon so now we're actually gonna get into the code there hasn't really been any new codes added but uh, there might actually be a code this valentine's day because they've done it for the past four years inside of build modes so be on the lookout for a happy valentine's day code that could give stars or hearts all that stuff but let's go ahead and get into every single working code inside of here so if i just type in hide right there there's one if i type in uh chill uh thrill 709 was here if we type this one in this is going to give you a firework that's actually a very very old item so now that we have that if we actually type in squid army like this this is going to give us 22 gold and also 22 snow blocks so you guys can use that to build you know whatever you want and there's also a few others i believe there's high as well oh i already redeemed that one there's equal sign and d just like this that's going to give you five gold and then there's equal sign and p just like this and those are pretty much all the codes inside the game but like i said be on the lookout for more now let's get into the secret item locations which are literally 10 times better than the codes inside the game these secret item locations to give you guys some pretty insane and stuff so let's go ahead and take a look by the way guys i would recommend getting these item locations because you never know when they could actually be removed from the game so make sure you guys get them because it's literally free robux items let's go ahead and take a look for the first one go inside of the enchanted forest stage and actually fall through the small crack that's inside of the outside of the stage you then are going to grab these berries and do one blue one and two white ones and you're actually going to get the sleep potion right here and with the sleep potion you're going to throw it at the eyeball you're going to actually unlock the chest right here and this chest is going to award you three potions and also some gold as well to get the golden harpoon instead of spending robux you can actually go inside of this stage right here go up to this tv and you actually want to click this button on the arcade controller so once you actually click this button it's going to bring you to the inside of the boss fight and it's going to go through some waves of boss fight it'll actually shoot these cubes at you you actually want to dodge the cubes you do not want to make contact with them because they will deal damage to you so you just want to dodge as many as you can you want to go through about three phases of boss fights and then once it's finally over you'll get awarded the golden harpoon but to be very careful because this can be a little bit laggy and if you make any contact with the cubes it will make you die at the start over again but as you can see when you actually finish it this chest will fall down from the top of the stage you go and claim it and you get 200 gold and also two harpoons and i will say guys the really good thing about the golden harpoon not only can you get it for free but it's a harpoon that doesn't have a timer on it and it's actually used for many glitches inside of the game it's honestly one of my favorite items i use it a lot has no timer on it at all so if you actually notice here if i shoot this one and this one you'll notice how this one actually has a 30 second timer then a reset but unlike the golden harpoon the golden harpoon will not do that and you can see golden harpoons are inside the shop for 250 robux so by getting these items you're saving the robux right there so it's definitely worth it now the next item on the list is the mega thruster right here wait is this called the mega thruster it's called the ultra thruster it's one of them this is also inside of the shop for 250 robux for five of them so it also is pretty spendy as well but you guys can still get it for free because there's a secret room inside of one of the stages that you guys can actually unlock it let's take a look make your way inside of the toxic waste stage and actually shoot this wall with the cannon or you know anything that can explode and you guys get it right there you do have to make sure to actually shoot the wall or else that you won't actually be able to get inside of it so make sure you shoot the wall beforehand get the thruster that's simple and easy now we're gonna go ahead and get into yet again another item location that you guys can unlock it gets even better than this and uh let's go ahead and take a look Getting portals inside a build-a-boat is extremely easy. All you have to do is go inside the neon stage and 
and shoot the crystals on the wall with the cannon. You guys can see I even did this on a brand new account and I was able to do it very, very easily. I just had a cannon on my, on my, you know, platform right here. I had jets and I just flew around and shot the crystals on the wall. Now, it was a little bit harder on a new account to do, but it is still good. And once you actually shoot enough crystals on the wall, it'll actually put a really cool effect on your avatar. You guys will see here in just a second what actually happens. Right there, you guys will see all the neon crystals will shoot at you at once. And what you actually are going to do is you're going to get teleported inside of a maze. And this maze is going to have these crystals that you need to actually bring back. So walk through this area right here. It's going to bring you inside the main entrance. You'll see some portals on the left and right. Go to the left portal and just you'll enter the maze. So I don't really have a guide on how to actually get through this maze super fast. You just have to go through until you actually find the crystals. I mean, it doesn't really take long, but if you're doing it with friends, it'll be even faster. Uh, it'll actually be like three times as fast if you have people helping you. I mean, even seven times as fast if you have a maxed out server. But anyway, you guys get the idea. Have friends help you out. If not, it's whatever. Grab the crystals. You want to actually bring them back over to where you originally came from, and you actually want to bring the crystal right up to this like pillar right here. You're going to place it inside of there, and then once you actually get all three pillars fully filled up, you guys will see, uh, once you have all the crystals right there, this chest will actually spawn in, and bam, there you guys go. You can actually go over, unlock it, you get 200 gold and four portals right there. Portals are used all the time inside of Build Boat. This is probably one of the most useful items. It's used in a ton of AFK grinders, gold glitches, getting around the map super fast and easy, and all around, it is a very, very fun item. You can even turn them fully transparent, so you can just teleport from one place to another. One of the best blocks I think Build Boat's ever added, and I, I mean, I recommend you guys get this thing right now if you have not done so already because these are also inside the shop how much are these things these things are 250 robux for eight of them so there you guys go go ahead and get these things for free inside the game while they're still there it's literally just a free robux item going inside the clock tower stage at the top of every hour there'll be a lever that actually unlocks on the left hand clock tower right here so if it's like eight o'clock or nine o'clock ten o'clock literally it doesn't matter what time it is at the top of the hour this is gonna open for five minutes go in there open up the switch it'll actually bring you down inside of this area right here a whole like thing will actually open up underneath the ground and it'll actually bring you to the fabby plushie which you guys can claim Here's the lever right here in case you guys are wondering what it looks like. For the Zeg plushie, go over inside of the arcade stage, drop down, and you actually want to play this mini game right here. You want to actually try to get that flashing light in between these two magnets right here. So this is literally overall the main thing you're actually trying to do. And you guys can see right here, boom, just like that, I got the Zeg plushie. That simple and easy. For Worthy Ones plushie, go over, shoot this cabin inside of this stage with uh, a cannon or like a hand cannon, literally does not matter. Go inside of it and you guys will actually see the worthy one plushie right there. Boom. That's how you guys get that. For PvP items, what you actually want to do is go inside of the castle stage and actually shoot the wall on the left-hand side with the cannon. You guys can see right here, you want to shoot right about there. And it's actually going to open up a secret area. And inside the secret area, you're actually going to fight some noobs that actually uh, not only give you gold, but they also end up giving you free items once you fully complete it. The items you actually get from this are the mounted bow, the wizard staff, and also the mounted knight sword. So these three items, you guys get and you also get some gold as well for going through the waves of the noobs and defeating them but yeah guys there's pretty much all the codes and all the free items you guys can actually get inside of build a boats but we are still going to actually include the cakes because you can still unlock these on your accounts anniversary they are still available inside of the game so there you guys go make sure you guys like the video and subscribe turn on that notification bell and i'll see you guys all inside the next one peace out and goodbye